<laughs> sorry, I took a breath and I, okay. So talking about closed and open circuits, we are going to do a Google slide. It is not terribly long. All right, so we've got electric current, closed circuit, circuit, open circuit. So again, you're just going to have to drag and drop these into the correct place. When any parts of a circuit are disconnected, when there is an unbroken path for the current, a broken path, um, it created from a continuous flow of electricity, a complete circus circuit, the path that can the current flows. Apparently, I can't talk today. I think I've made too many videos, and that's what the problem is. All right, so just move those into the correct spots. And then here you have closed or open. So you're going to need to decide. Oh, pause for a second. Okay, so you're going to need to decide if it is closed or an open circuit. So remember, it is considered closed when there is a break in the continuous movement. Make sure to look for everything. Okay. Is that touching that? Nope. So that would be considered closed. Okay. All right. Do the rest of those. Using the line on the toolbar, draw a closed circuit. So you can use this and oops, that is not how you do that. Okay. So you would do something like that. Okay. Um, and the same thing, create an open circuit. Okay. So what would it look like? So click in this tool right here and you get the little crosshairs. Would that be open or closed? Okay. So do those two. All right. Below are the diagram showing two circuits commonly used by electricians and engineers. Answer the question below. What on the diagram tells you the circuit is opened or closed? Okay, so this is a closed circuit and this is an open circuit. So where, what tells you? Okay, you guys can answer that one. All right, so now I'm talking about series and parallel circuits. We talked about this just a little bit with the notes. Um, so let's do some of these together. So a series circuit is one pathway for the current, okay? Um, old tiny Christmas lights is a series circuit. The new tiny Christmas lights are parallel, meaning that a series circuit, if one light goes out, the whole strand will not work. But if it's a parallel circuit, if one goes out, it'll still work because there's more than one pathway for a current, okay? A break will stop the current and lights will not stay on. That would be series. And a break will not stop the current and the lights will stay on. So the lights in our classrooms, um, well, at least for Gauzer, they are a parallel circuit. If one goes out, which happens all the time, uh, the lights will still stay on. All right, so looking at series or parallel right here. So this would be a series because there is one pathway. Yeah. Um, this would be a parallel because there's more than one pathway. All right. And then I think you guys can finish those last four. All right. So the same thing. So what we did with the line earlier, use the line tool on the toolbar and draw a series circuit. I think you can even, yeah, you could do curved too. I don't know how that would work. Oh, okay. All right. So you can do. So that would be, you just have to like have. So that would be a series. Okay. That's cool. I did not know you could do that. I just learned something while I was on the video with you. So when you go to the line, so this is the line, you can click the select line and you can choose um a different but if you do this the curve you have to make sure that you click along the way because you hear my mouse clicking and that way it'll curve okay <laughs> and double click stop all right so there's that and then the next one is parallel oops so do the same thing and 
then, so this one is parallel circuits, drag the ring boxes to finish each sentence. All right. It is a parallel circuit if there is more than one possible way flow of electricity. If the one bulb is removed, uh, if one bulb is removed of fails or fails, then the bulbs stay as bright as if each one was the only bulb in the circuit. That is true. In a parallel circuit, the bulbs stay as bright as if each one was the only bulb in a circuit. Okay. I accidentally skipped series. All right. So series. It is a series circuit when there's only one pathway. So series is one path. Parallel means many. So if you think about parallel lines, there are two. So if you think, keep that in your mind, that'll help. It is a closed circuit if um, a bulb is unscrewed or there is a break in the path. All the light bulbs light. It is a closed circuit, yes, if all the light bulbs light. It is open if there is a break in the path. Um, compare it. Fill up the Venn diagram. And I want you to do this. You can do the Venn diagram comparing um, series and parallel. And we've talked about the Christmas lights. And then I want you to do this one as well. So in conclusion, what you are responsible for is this one. Finishing that one. This, this, this. Finishing that. This, 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 and this. Okay, so just remember on these that you can use the line tool right here. All right, if you have any questions, let me know.